So Android 15 Beta 2 is now live and initially you may not see any changes when compared to A14 but there are some small and awesome changes in there. So I'll start with the lock screen, the font is now larger, no changes in the home screen but the widget page now has a suggestion panel which is gonna show you some suggestions. A huge visual change is in the volume control panel which when expanded shows material use style thicker volume progress bar for media, notifications or ring and we have bunch of options to control in there. This is how it looks in front of A14 which in itself is hideous so definitely not the best design but matches with other material use sliders in this OS. Second massive change is this private space which now resides in your phone's app drawer. All you have to do is enable it from the settings, set it up and then click on this small lock icon to unlock it using your password. So this is how it is gonna work, you'll have your own private apps and data you can use. This got its own account, data, anyone photos you shoot in private space is gonna remain there only. So you guys can see this photo app is different from the original one, got different data and photos. So a private space is finally here but it's not so private because anyone is gonna see this locked section in your app drawer, something you all should note. The third feature is you guys can now save application pair that is split screen on your home screen as an icon for quick access. So whenever you click on that, two applications are gonna open simultaneously in a split screen. This is Dreamface AI Photo Animator. You guys can upload any still image and make it talk, sing or even dance. The best part is you guys can create or use dynamic avatar which is gonna speak what you want it to speak. Yes, can even change the voice of the dynamic avatar and that lip sync is gonna blow your mind. Hey guys, it's Tech Rotor and make sure to try out Dreamface. Create memes, change face expression, enhance photos and even get your own AI portrait headshots like this. So download it right now for iOS and Android, link in the description. Some changes in the settings, Bluetooth got new settings which automatically turn it on the day after you have disabled it. New contrast setting is now live in home screen customization. Predictive back gestures are default now so you guys can see which app you are going back in advance before swiping back. Some small changes, new quick setting tile for hearing devices and the animations are now faster and smoother than A14. Google also made several announcements like Project Astra coming to Android soon which can reason in real time. What is that part of the speaker called? That is the tweeter. It produces high frequency sounds. Give me a creative alliteration about these. Creative crayons color cheerfully. They certainly craft colorful creations. What does that part of the code do? This code defines encryption and decryption functions. It seems to use a some security features, Gemini Pro and more. This all guys, thanks so much for watching. Your thoughts in the comment section below and I'll meet you guys in the next one. Peace out.